Hello, my name is Emma, and in today's lesson, we are going to be learning some important telephone expressions. Okay? I know a lot of students get very scared when they have to talk on the phone, and it's understandable. It can be very、um, scary when you can't see the person's face when you're talking to them. So, one great idea if you're afraid of talking on the phone in English. Is to memorize key expressions that we use all the time. This way, it will improve your listening, you will know what people will probably say on the phone, and your speaking will improve too. All right? Now, in this video, we're actually going to practice these expressions together. In my pocket, I have my cell phone. All right? So, what is going to happen? Is I will teach you an expression and then I will pretend to be on the phone. You can pretend to be on the phone too. I will say something and you say the correct expression to me. All right? So if you don't understand, that's okay. You will in a moment. Let's get started. Now, when somebody calls you, ring, 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 the first thing you say is, hello? As in a question. Hello? All right. And then what happens? The person who's calling asks a question. They can do this in different ways. I've listed four different ways, the most common. Sometimes they'll say, Is so and so there, please? Is Emma there, please? Is Daniela there, please? Is Yvonne there, please? Okay, very common way. And notice, please, very important to be polite. You can also say, This is Emma calling for whoever you're calling. So if I'm calling you, I might say, Oh, hello, this is Emma calling for Daniel. This is Emma calling for Joseph. This is Emma calling for Pete. Okay.、Um, So, this is common, especially if you're at work. This is the one we would use a lot at work. This one is a little bit more informal. You'd probably use this one more if you're calling your friends or、um, calling someone in not a business situation. This is also another informal one is in. So, all of these blanks are the name of the person who、um, the caller wants to speak to. Is Emma in? Is John in? Is Mary in? Okay, so again, hello, is Mary in? Informal. Last one. May I please speak to Emma? May I please speak to Mary? May I please speak to the doctor? All right, this one is more formal. So we have、ah, sort of formal, informal, formal, informal. And the last one, formal. All right. So let's get your phone out, all right, whether you have a real cell phone or your hand, and let's practice a statement. So you're going to be calling me. You're going to use one of these expressions. Pick whichever one you want and practice it. All right. Let's get started. Ring, 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 ring. Hello. Perfect. All right. So you can watch this video again and again. Practice, practice, practice until you have it memorized, until it is easy for you. All right. Now, how do I respond? Or how, how, how does the person you're calling respond? If you say, Is Emma there, please? I would say, Speaking, which means, Yes, it's me, it's Emma. I wouldn't say that. I would just say, Speaking. Or I could say, Emma speaking. Emma speaking, how can I help you? This is Emma, or this is he, this is she. All right, so again, these represent s the, the name of the person.、Um, this, these blanks are names. All right, so let's try one. I want you to pick any of these. All right. Now, 
I'm sorry, there are so many of you. I probably will not pick your name when I ask this question. So today I am going to call you all Bob. I'm sorry if, if uh, that's a problem, but today you are Bob, all right? So I want you to say either speaking, Bob speaking, this is Bob, just for practice. All right, so get your phone ready. Ring, 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 ring. So you say hello, and I say, is Bob there, please? What do you say? Good, very good. All right, so let's learn some more expressions. Okay, great. So we've gone through the first part of a phone call. Hello, is Emma there, please? Speaking, all right. Now what? What if someone calls you and you pick up, but they're not looking for you? They're looking for your brother. They're looking for your mother. They're looking for someone else. What do you say? So the conversation, hello, is Emma there, please? Um, one moment, please. Just a moment, please. Hang on a sec. I'll get Bob. I'll get blank, okay? So one moment, please. Just a moment, please. Hang on a sec, I'll get, and here's the name. So if the call is not for you, tell the person to wait, but don't use the word wait. That would sound rude. These all mean wait. The first two are more polite. One moment, please. The last one is more, Informal. If you're talking to someone maybe who's young, who's a friend, more informal. Hang on a sec. Sec means second. Hang on a sec. I'll get him. I'll get her. All right? So I want you to practice this. I'm going to ask for Frank, and I want you to choose one of these and say it. All right? Is Frank there, please? All right, good. All right, so what comes after this in a phone conversation usually? If the person asks for someone like Frank, maybe Frank isn't there. You say this if Frank is there. If Frank's not there, you can say something like this. You can say, I'm sorry, she or he, he, she, she's not here at the moment. She's not here right now. Would you like to leave a message? All right. I'm sorry. Emma's not here at the moment. Would you like to leave a message? I'm sorry. Frank's not here at the moment. Can I take a message? All right. So I want you to practice this. So get your phone out. Ready? I just want you to say this. Is Emma there, please? All right, great. Now you can hang up your phone. Usually there's more to a phone conversation such as saying goodbye, <laughs> um, but we won't get to that today. We will get to how to take a message and how to end a phone conversation in part two of this video. So to practice the expressions we've learned today, please check out our website at www.ingvid.com. There's a quiz there and you can practice these expressions, all right? So until next time, take care.